My name is Bob Lindsay, and it's time that we take the hopeless out of the homeless situation and actually do something about it. Good intentions do not guarantee good results. The politically motivated, hands-off homeless policy has turned into hepatitis A, feces and urine running down the streets at our children's feet. Rampant, indecent exposure has become the norm in broad daylight and beggars approaching our cars and demanding and hitting our hoods in disgust if we don't give cash is commonplace. Tents block our sidewalks while families walk in the traffic. LA workers are accosted and children and their families are living in cars, alleys, and in parks in masses. I believe the most recent count of homeless we can find is 58,000 in LA County alone. The current sheriff has been in office for more than three years and sat idle watching the homeless population increase. He has attended roasts and elegant functions as the most vulnerable go unattended. He focuses on buckles and stickers and crime skyrockets and children are looking for a place to lay their head. From his swearing in and for the next 1,000 days, McDonald, the reformer, had one deputy and a part-time relief assigned to 4,100 square miles of LA County homeless infestation. The sorrow, the need, the despair wasn't a concern to this former police chief experimenting to be the sheriff. Now in McDonald's fourth year, his election campaign year, this lack of homeless planning and lack of progress and failure of compassion stands to lose him the votes he needs to keep his job. If it was discovered that he only had one person assigned to an entire county of homeless, he might be hailed incompetent by some who have a heart for this dire situation. McDonald immediately, according to newly homeless assigned personnel, has added 15 deputies for show as a press performance and for self-gratification to bolster his June 5th, 2018 campaign. I simply thank God he made a decision as the homeless are finally served and better late than never. Today, those 15 homeless assigned deputies are my heroes attempting to clean up four years worth of work. I don't know who the one deputy is or who it was assigned alone, but they deserve a round of applause, a meritorious award, and an all expenses paid vacation somewhere for doing the work of 15 people for over three years. That truly is a deputy warrior. From bad to worse, recently sheriff's deputies made the news and were accused of dumping a homeless male picked up in Palos Verdes and released in San Pedro. An uproar ensued, and rightfully so, as perception and politics rules and not necessarily compassion. The drop-off was in daylight, and I tend to believe, based on my 40 years of experience, that the deputies were trying to help. The optics of the press piece are bad, but worse are this sheriff's policies and three years of negligence that he disguises so it never makes the news. The deputies aren't to blame. Their boss is. But as this sheriff's record shows, the fingers will always point down. My name is Bob Lindsay. I'm running for sheriff of Los Angeles County. As sheriff, I aim to focus on aiding those in need and bringing them hope, help, and understanding. Reach out to my campaign, Bob, the number four sheriff.com to volunteer and vote June 5th, 2018. God bless.